The Lynn and Lewis Wolfson II Florida Moving Image Archives holds a collection of promotional films from General Development Corporation, a Florida land development company with an infamous history. First established by the Miami-based Mackle Brothers in 1954, GDC became one of the most prolific developers of new communities in Florida, selling lots on an installment basis. Though the Mackles left the company in 1962 and went on to develop Marco Island on the Gulf Coast, land sales and community developments continued until the late 1980s when GDC was accused of fraudulent sales practices. Criminal indictments and then bankruptcy finally shuttered the corporation in 1991. Despite the colorful and controversial history of GDC, their promotional films serve as a visual record of the history of land development and how these new post-World War II communities in Florida were marketed around the world. You swear the water's bluer, the sky above looks newer, and the magic of Florida, nothing ever was truer. Some of the films show GDC staff at work planning, building, and then selling lots and homes to prospective buyers. The films also give us a glimpse at how various communities looked before they were developed and populated. One of these planned communities was Port Malabar, located south of Cape Canaveral and now part of Palm Bay. It had everything. Shopping, open spaces, good schools, places to worship, and Anita Bryant and her husband Bob Green praising all of these benefits. Other GDC communities around Florida included Port Charlotte, Port La Belle, Port St. Lucie, and Silver Springs Shores. Preservation work on the GDC collection continues, so search the Wolfson Archives online catalog for general development to see what is available. I'm standing here, really, and I'd like to be a, simply a spokesman for my bro brother Robert and his family. So grateful for how this thing turned out. Barbara is well, safe, and in extremely good condition. Thank you, everybody. I just feel wonderful. I really do.